deep in the cosmos. Scientists have detected a neutron star that is far closer than we ever could have expected. We may be in the clear for now, but if a collision were ever to take place, it's expected that it would completely wipe out humanity and all signs of life. And to make things even worse, there would be absolutely nothing we could do about it. So what exactly is this new discovery that has scientists so shocked? And most importantly, what would happen if a neutron star collides with Earth? Neutron stars are the densest objects in the universe. A tablespoon of neutron star material would weigh about 1 billion tons on Earth, according to NASA. As you may have guessed, it consists mainly of neutrons and is covered by a relatively thin shell. They pack quite a punch, but they are rather small bodies. Neutron stars typically have a radius of about 6 miles, but with a mass of about 1.4 solar masses. So yes, they are small, but also super heavy and dense. Recently, scientists observed a highly energetic star that released a burst of energy so violent that it would take the Sun thousands of years to produce a similar amount, all compressed into a fraction of a second. The star in question is known as a magnetar, which is a type of neutron star. According to the Swinburne University of Technology, these extremely dense stars produce the most intense magnetic fields in the known universe that are a thousand trillion times stronger than Earth's. In short, neutron stars and magnetars are very extreme objects. They are also so rare that we have only observed around 30 in the Milky Way galaxy. This lack of evidence has only made scientists want to look harder and eventually they came across the closest known neutron star in the universe. A neutron star with the name RXJ1856.5-3754 was found to be the closest star of this type to our solar system and is located about 400 light years away. However, if it gets any closer, we would begin to really feel the impact of it. Luckily enough for you, this isn't an event that would take place in the next few years, and that's a good thing, because the effects would be on a level that's hard to even imagine. We all know that mass can immediately interact with objects that are near it. More mass equals more gravity. But as we mentioned, the mass of a neutron star is substantial and consequential too. The mass of the neutron star is so heavy that if one were to enter our solar system, all of the planets would quickly fall out of their orbits, but it would result in a lot more than just some simple shifts. In fact, the planets we know and love could begin to violently crash into each other because of the epic gravitational chaos caused by a neutron star. If Earth was pushed away from the Sun, even just a little, it would have devastating effects. The water on Earth would freeze, and life would become impossible as we drift away from the Sun and lose all of its warmth. A new ice age would begin, one that is far worse than any that has come before. But what happens if the Earth is moved in the opposite direction and is actually drawn closer to the Sun because of a neutron star? That too would have a cataclysmic impact on human civilization and everything that resides on our planet. Do you think our summers are hot now? Imagine if we were pulled to the sun and the temperature of our planet shot up. The world would shrivel up and dry out, leaving us with nowhere to hide. This might not happen all at once either. In fact, it could take centuries. Imagine year after year of hotter days as a blanket of suffocating heat wrapped itself snugly around our planet. That sounds like something straight out of a bleak sci-fi film. And what about radiation? Well, you don't have to be a NASA scientist to know how vital it is that humans avoid as much radiation as possible. 
a neutron star wouldn't come to our galaxy with just dense gravity. It would also arrive with radiation levels that would lay waste to all of us. Remember when we said that the crust of a neutron star is very hard yet also very thin? Well, right below its surface lies the sort of power we can't even imagine. Under intense pressure, the outer shell of a neutron star could crack, and if it does, a powerful flash of radiation would occur. A single flash from a compromised neutron star could create as much energy as our sun produces in 300,000 years. A neutron star doesn't even have to be close to us to wreak havoc either. Even if this flash occurs 10 light years away from us, it can make its presence known. A surge of radiation from that distance could eliminate our ozone layer and be equivalent to 10 kilotons of nuclear bombs going off. The impact a neutron star has on a human body would be just as bad too. The magnetic field of a neutron star can be millions of times stronger than what we are used to on Earth. In fact, if you were only 620 miles from such a star, your body would dissolve because of the destruction that the magnetic field would have on the atoms that compose your body. Scientists also predict that if a neutron star collides with our solar system, that it would cause something called spaghettification, which is when the mass or magnetic field of a celestial body can stretch and morph other objects, even planets. Take a look at the moon tonight and imagine it being pulled apart in two different directions. Now imagine that happening to Earth and all the people on it. That's exactly what a neutron star collision could do. There is one other destructive option for a neutron star and it involves our very own Sun. A neutron star that enters our universe could not only swallow up the Sun, it could in fact merge with it. A star would pull gas away from the Sun which would soon become a donor star. These two would remain separate, likely on either side of our planet, and would throw us into perpetual daytime. And while some people might like the idea of never having to worry about the sun going down, you have to remember that with two stars comes double the heat and double the radiation too. As you can see, a neutron star is not something to mess with. Despite some false alarms in the space community, we are not currently at risk of anyone coming close to us. Still, scientists continue to observe neutron stars throughout space and know that when one eventually does reach us, it's not going to be a pretty ending. Thanks for watching, and while you are still here, go ahead and click the video on your screen for more mind-blowing videos about space. I'll see you there.